Shock and confusion fell up down as the news broke that the Pittsburgh Penguins are reportedly in talks to sell to the ownership group of the Boston Red Sox. The anger because of the Pittsburgh Boston um, rivalry um, that makes everybody nervous when you when you see something attached to Boston. Then came the questions mainly directed at city leaders about the impact. I've been in contact with the team and I know that they're working in order to be able to do it, but I'll hold my comments until there is a signature on a piece of paper and there is something actually to comment on. Outside of driving fans into the city and bringing business to local establishments, the Penguins as an organization have invested in a number of projects. They kind of have their hands in a lot of things right now um, in the area, so that is a thought too, like what, what's going to happen to the developments that they have planned. Particularly the Lower Hill Redevelopment Project. Construction is already underway for the first phase of new businesses and green space. The mayor tells us as for that project, community members don't have to worry. Anything that would be part of the agreement that we worked on, whether it's the CSIP agreement with the community, whether it's the lease agreement with the Penguins and the arena and keeping them in Pittsburgh, anything dealing with that stays in place. None of that changes. While this construction continues, Carly Moore at the Super Bowl says she's staying positive that no matter what happens, the Pens will stay here in Pittsburgh and help keep this part of the city alive. We're reporting live tonight, Nicole Ford, Channel 11 News.